Stop the Bleeding is made possible by an unrestricted educational grant from Baxter International, Inc. Benny, Stacy, and I are here in Missouri to entertain the families at Midwest Hemophilia's Family Fun Fair. I mean, I don't want to overstate my importance here, but I might be the most important thing that's ever happened in Missouri. So I created this booth for you. We've absorbed so much information about bleeding disorders that we are well equipped to answer any questions you may have on the subject. You can ask us anything. Franklin and Arnold are with an old buddy of mine in New Mexico at a golf fundraiser. Stop that itch in a sitch with Mitch's no itch tourniquet. I am hungry to get your products and more exposure in markets outside of the Southwest. And Jackie. It's all gonna come together once this food is made. So you haven't made any of this yet? No. Maybe you didn't hear me. Uh, I said, uh, the amount of time that I'm spending in the sand today, I, I might as well be David Hasselhoff. <laughs> you know? David Hasselhoff, because of Baywatch and Baywatch, yeah, yeah. All right, whatever. Um, all right. Uh, you know, um, all this time uh, spent down here in the sand um, whoa, whoa, actually makes me think of um, the hemophilia community at Rockaway Beach. Now that is a, a place that is ripe for, f for financial gain. Uh, you know, and actually there is something that I wanted you to see that I... It is this video of dogs drinking out of straws. That's amazing. I know, they don't even have lips. Does Shane know that you haven't made anything yet? No, no gonna burden him with anything else. Besides, there were so many food allergies and restrictions, I, I didn't know what to buy and make. Pam, you have to bake something. It's kind of an important part of the bake sale. Why haven't, <laughs> oh, why haven't you done anything to move this forward? Okay, look, the truth is, I just started getting Shane to go to these chapter meetings. He really seems to be enjoying it. That's great. I know, he, he can finally talk to his friends about his hemophilia. It's amazing. Look, I'm just afraid that if today doesn't go well, if nobody shows up, he's just gonna end up hating having hemophilia again. What's wrong? People keep coming over and asking me questions about stuff. You're working the information booth, Benny. Yeah, no, I, I know what it is. I just, I just don't know why I'm here. It's good leadership practice for when you take over Stop the Bleeding. Yeah, and I've been thinking about it, and I don't want to do that. But Stop the Bleeding needs you. And they have me. I, mean, I do what I do. Spencer does what he does. Jackie signs papers. Franklin sweats a lot. Arnold doesn't wear shoes. And it all works out. We could do so much more. But, I love what I do now, and, and, and I don't want to change that. I don't want to change who I am. I'm gonna go for a walk. Benny, where are you going? Somewhere where I can think in peace. I remember the, the doctor calling and saying, you know, he'll never be able to play contact sports. He'll never be able to have any major surgeries. So as a new mom, I was just really panicky. I just could not, I thought, oh my gosh. Then he said, now let me tell you the good news. And he said, we have this new drug called Factor Eight, which contains a colliding agent found in blood. It's a small known part of a big unknown machine. Just a small known. Come on, Franklin. You can do this, okay? You're a businessman. He's a businessman. You can do this. You can do this, do this, do this, do this. Look to your clubs, 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 clubs. Arnold, is that you? In spirit. And also physically. What, why are you sabotaging me? Sabotaging you? I am trying to help you. What, by tearing up my cards and throwing my research into the woods? I'm just trying to get him to stop making that 
face. What face? The face. The face you make when I talk about Miss Pac-Man. I don't make a face. No? Well, what about last week when I was telling you about when I beat my high score and I ate all the air? Ha! Yeah. Yes. Exactly that face. He is making that face and you can't allow him to do that. You gotta avoid talking about worky stuff and hitting the ball bad. All right, well, I'm sorry, but you have to speak worky stuff on the golf course, okay? That's what golfing is. You gotta talk business in order to make business. All right, fine. Sure, you're probably right. I'm just here as your brother to support you and I probably wouldn't be here if it weren't for you. I'd be at home eating cherries and ghosts. What? Miss Pac-Man. That's the face. That's the one. Maybe the solution is to get Shane involved. I mean, if he participates and nobody comes, that might be even worse. And he's gonna feel like he failed. There's something that my boss says, and I cannot believe I'm quoting him, but he says, leap and the net will appear. Or it won't. But either way, you will have leapt. Yeah, I think you gotta take a chance. Let Shane leap. Wow. Your boss sounds like a really smart guy. Let Shane leap. Okay. So where do we start? There's no food, there's no ingredients, and there's no publicity. Oh, I wanna help them. I need to help them. With Spencer, usually I'm the one who has to clean up the mess. But here, there's no mess. There's nothing here. I get to make the mess, and then I get to clean it up. <laughs> 